la parole à la rabbi David Feldman, qui est toujours avec nous pour supporter la cause palestinienne. So who will give? Elle va donner son speech in English. You'll forgive me for English. I'm not the first breaking the rule. Assalamu alaikum. We are standing here on the Palestinian Nakba Day on May 15 in the heart of Montreal to remember the suffering people of Palestine. Let me tell you my personal experience. I visited so, Gaza, I visited anyone? refugee camps in Lebanon, so I visited you? many other com Palestinian communities. It is sad and it's oh painful God. that the stories we are listening to, to the tragedies that have happened, is not only in the past, it is unfortunately continuing to the present day. It's already 68 years and we don't see the end to it. We still don't see the light at the end of the tunnel. It is our obligation to stand up, to remember Palestine and to stop this occupation. Let me tell you something very important. Netanyahu insists that his state should be considered, should be called a Jewish state. Why is he insisting to call this the Jewish state? What's wrong the state of Israel? Or what's, why is it wrong the state of Satan? Why the Jewish state? Because he wants to present this image as all Jews support Israel. By doing so, he wants to, he wants to silence you if you stand up against the occupation, if you stand up against that criminal movement, they would blame you being anti-Semitic. This is the tragedy. We have to remember, if crimes are being committed, we should speak up. But we should be very clear. We should remember, we should educate the difference between Judaism and Zionism. Judaism is a religion. There are Jewish people attached to Judaism, which does not represent Zionism, which is a criminal political movement. We should stand up. We must stand up. We must support Palestine. Hopefully, in the near future, if we stand up in the right approach, if we do address this, us as Jewish people, others as from Palestinian descent, others from other communities. We should join hands together and speak up for God's creation. We should speak up for the rights of humanity. And we should speak up for the rights of all us, of, of all of us. And then we should be, we will be able to see a brighter future to Muslims, Christians and Jews in Palestine and throughout the world. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum. Okay, for free.